the Washington Monument gets, you know, blasted with a bolt of lightning. It's all the evil coming out of there. Kind of reminds you of the pyramids. Lightning hitting the tip of the pyramids. What, you know, what are they energizing down underneath the ground? That's crazy. That's insane. We had a Brock fire, 20% contained on the east side of Shasta Lake. Shasta Trinity National Forest, California. The Brock fire is 20% contained. Firefighters worked through the night. Fresh crews are out Friday morning. Better mapping puts the lightning caused fire at 15 acres. Lightning, huh? Tyson Foods joins Bill Gates and Cargill to invest in the lab-grown meat. Future of proteins. Do not overcook. Ugh, man, Franken food. I knew it. I knew they were going to push this this uh, fake meat because of this food crisis, and then here it is in an article. So what they're saying, with all the talks of the coming food shortages in America and around the world, it appears that there is future investments being made into the lab-based meats. Tyson Foods appears to be the leading edge of this venture. According to a report from Bloomberg, Tyson Foods is boosting its bet on meat that comes from the lab instead of the slaughterhouse. The the guy's name just keeps coming up, Bill Gates. This is actually a really old article, like 10 years ago. Bill Gates cloud whitening trials is a dangerous experiment. Campaigners say a Bill Gates backed geoengineering project to whiten clouds and reduce global warming is risky. Not to mention what it does to our health. 